Hey guys, what's up? Um, back again with another uh, Shattered Laloon attack by Hagrid here. Um, it's another air attacker from my clan. You can see this base is set up. A lot of people are putting their expos down. They're not so worried about those air attacks anymore with all the AI changes. Uh, if expos are down, try to work around it. This guy's got an easy gettable hero set and what I mean by that is the queen might be buried deep but he didn't block her from one simple jump she's one jump away from getting schooled so also when you jump those the air defenses are one step away from getting smashed as well he's got an anchor point on the outside these anchor points a lot of people are using on the outside to collect golems. Hey, if they're going to set you an anchor point to put a golem where you can clear a funnel, go ahead and use it. So multiple mistakes made uh, where people think it's a strong defense. It's really not a strong defense. So what Hagrid's going to do is on a shattered Laloon attack is he's going to set his golems in on there, which is Archer Tower's easily reach. And then he's going to break the funnel on the outside to get his troops on the inside. Throw one jump down. And then he's going to do what I was doing for a while. Is he's going to throw a rage on his troops in here. He rage the troops. They're going to kill the queen. The CC is going to pull. I think he's got a dragon some other troops in there. Anyways, queen and whiz are going to smash through the CC. And go ahead and pick up those extra buildings. Now what you have to worry about in there... See where the CC radius is? It's going to let his golem sit down here and his troops clean up while you're not worried about it. Um, but what you have to worry about is clearing out these buildings and not hitting these whiz towers. So they can merc a couple loons, but not a big problem on how he does it. With two golems down, you pretty much only have the option to use three hounds now. These air defenses are pretty damn close to the outside, so it's not a problem. You throw two loon or two hounds down and you start looning the outside and a hound and start looning the outside. He does it so quick that he only blows up one hound. And that's even with the extra hounds rolling around. Double spot, double spot, double spot, single, single. I'm guessing on the interior how this is set you're probably gonna see your Teslas here bombs bomb maybe Tesla Tesla either way how it's gonna work he has so many troops left over um, even though this is two air defenses this one's blown out this way not a problem because you're taking care of this area this one's blown out this way that's really not a problem because you're going to take it out anyway. So your loons and hounds are free to flow. You need to make sure which way your air blowers are rolling so you don't roll directly into them now. That's where a lot of people are tripping up. Take a look at his troop setup, which is pretty much what I said. Um, you're going to see two of your own golems, three hounds, a max hound in the CC, 14, two cleanup troops, and that's important. He does this so fast that his cleanup takes just as long as taking down every single defense. He's got low-level heroes, so even though this is a max defense base and not yet max hall or, or uh, not walls, but max defense, he takes it down no problem. You got three rages. Um. I uh, haste there the jump to get over here and with that rage used you still have a rage for this a rage for this and a haste to get through the middle section so take a look at it flows down just exactly like I said and at 2 minutes and 45 seconds he's kinda cutting it close so throws down his golems he cuts that funnel, throws down his heroes to start marching in, throws down the jump, 
see what pops out is a dragon, two wizards, and an archer. Not a problem. Rages through him. And all his troops are under rage, so they're pounding down buildings quick. They smoke those heroes. Then he uses his king's rage. Still got his queen growing in strong, and he starts setting down his hounds and loons. So he's still got his queen and her ability to use. His loons are focusing directly on those air defenses. If you're going to do this style, I like raging the area that you throw your second down or your second hounds in first. That way, your first hound is not traveling over to that area and is going to travel to where your balloons are flowing. But either way, it takes care of business. So all the air defenses are down, Teslas are down. Now his hounds and loons flow around. He only blew up one hound. And that's it. He's still got two full hounds left. And that's where the slow cleanup comes down. He does throw down two goblins to help. But still takes a full minute for cleanup. That's where you gotta think maybe more cleanup troops. But they do it in no time flat. 100%. Two air sweepers. Max defense, low level heroes, it's still a viable option. So, hope that all makes sense. <clears throat> if you guys have any questions, let me know. Uh, go ahead and like and subscribe if you haven't. If you don't want to, well, good luck. And I'll see you guys next time.